Hi, I'm Bob Nowitzki. I'm here at uh, PAC Expo 2011 for Banner Engineering. I'm the uh, Senior Application Engineer for Vision. Uh, here we have the iView series. Uh, we have uh, the iView Plus BCR and we have the iView uh, Plus TG. The uh, main difference between these two models is one is this only does barcodes and this one will uh, do either uh, pattern matching or presence absence or looking for blemishes. We come in two different form factors. One we have the uh, integrated uh, touchscreen. And that's used for programming this. You do not need uh, any type of other software to program this. It's all done through the touchscreen and can only be done through the touchscreen. Here we also have the IVTG Plus, and this is the uh, remote touchscreen. And one, I can uh, remove the uh, screen, and up to 50 feet away, I can program this unit in case this unit is in a location where it's not handy to get to the uh, integrated touchscreen on the back. I can also put this back on the docking station remove the screen, unit will still operate, I can use this for protection or use it on other, uh, other uh, iView devices. Uh, the big thing for us at this show is that we now have the ability to communicate uh, industrial Ethernet and uh, what that means is that we can communicate via Modbus DCP or Ethernet IP and we're able to send images and also uh, information onto an HMI which is extremely powerful. Uh, two units have been very popular here at PAC Expo, um, especially the TG model. Uh, there's a number of applications where people are looking for the quality of their product as far as do I have the right label on the product and do I have, say, the right tub with the right lid. We've been seeing a number of those type of applications. Along with that, the barcode is an extremely popular uh, uh, device here at PAC Expo. And that's just the ease of use. Once I've got it up and running and focused, I'm reading the barcode right off the bat. I can then uh, communicate that information via RS-232 or uh, over Ethernet or using Modbus TCP or Ethernet IP.